firstborn spawn. What did I know of love's loneliness? Growing up, I thought love was only romantic love, fairy tale love. I would look into Snow White's magic mirror and picture myself as Cinderella, even though she lived in a castle and the projects looked more like some witch's prison. Mm. I was never attacked by ogres, but had a real life monster terrorizing my house. Mm. I would gaze into the mirror and ignore my family shouting. All the fighting and separation just drama from ugly stepbrothers and a wicked stepmother lying to me, telling me my father, the king, did not wish to see me. Mm. So I would close my eyes and fantasize, concentrate on achieving love at first sight. I always dreamt I would be my Prince Charming at the ball, except he must have been caught up slaying dra dragons or something. Cause at the age of 17, I woke up and realized no one was coming to save me. Mm. While I had been daydreaming about my escape, my father was protecting me all along, mm. willing to sacrifice his life for mine. He was there when the nightmare started, when I realized life would never be a fairy tale, and that those wolves chasing after me were as real as the sirens that haunted my sleep. I remember one winter Sunday, waking up to a gloomy watch morning. I kept hearing unsettling noises my first thought was, who the hell got shot now? Mm -hmm. Slowly I woke and dressed. I noticed the light on downstairs. It was my father who gets up early to make us breakfast. Outside the war rages on, while inside he makes our favorite pancakes, chocolate chip. Mm -hmm. The sizzling of bacon drowns out the sounds of helicopters. My nose is more interested in the smell of homemade hot chocolate than the gossiping outside. Mm -hmm. My father is our knight in shining armor to our small kingdom of our house. Strong and hardworking, yet gentle enough to kiss us goodbye. He always puts everything aside when I need him. When I'm sick, he makes healing potions, never missing a day off to take his princess out for ice cream. Mm. He always puts his family first, yet no one ever thanked them. Mm. Instead, the jealousy will cause us to fight like wicked step-siblings over a gold chain. You love her more than me. She's your favorite. I hate you. While he stood there making breakfast with cracked hands that ache the way my heart will ache when he is gone. Mm. 